Hello friend, this is Uday. In this video, I'm going to tell you about introduction to geology. Geology is an important subject for civil engineers and mining engineers. Geology is a branch of science which has a study of earth or simply it is called as earth science. The study of geology comprises of all earth about its origin structure composition and history so geology includes the study of origin of earth structure of earth composition of earth and history also includes the development of life and the nature of the process which carry on the earth's surface or interior of the earth. There are various branches of the geology like physical geology, mineralogy, petrology, hydrology, structural, historical, economic, stratigraphy and uh, resources engineering and etc. It's a wide range of branches. Geology is a wide variety of subject. Geology in mining engineering is used to know the method of mining of rock and mineral deposits on the surface of earth. So a mining engineer need to know what are the minerals that are stayed on the earth's surface. So it is used to find what are the minerals available on the earth's surface and also how to mine the rock present on the earth's surface. Coming to the physical geology, it deals with the physical agents like uh, wind, water, glaciers and sea waves and how they modify the surface of the earth continuously. Physical geology includes the study of ETD. Now here ETD is nothing but erosion, transportation and deposition. The physical geology plays a vital role in civil engineering as well as mining engineering. Next, going to the petrology. I wanna don't tell anything brief, it's because this is a very introductory video. Petrology is a geology which deals with the study of is a branch of geology. It deals with the study of rocks. Simply a rocks. Study of rocks is nothing but petrology. Remember, petrology doesn't mean the study of petrol or something like that in which the name says. It is about the study of rocks, not petrol. Now coming to the rocks, rocks are nothing but the aggregation of minerals found in earth crust so we have crust mantle and core so the topmost layer of earth is a crust uh, where the minerals can be found and the rocks are found so the study of rocks is nothing but the petrology it is very useful in the civil engineering point of view uh, for the selection of building stones and uh, road metals etc Rocks are of three types, mainly igneous, sedimentary and metamorphic.
the formation of these rocks uh, igneous sedimentary and metamorphic directly or indirectly affect the production and distribution of heat within the earth since the plate tectonics operates as an efficient heat loss mechanism the study of petrology is fundamental to understanding the large scale geodynamics of our planet going to the next let's study about structural geology what is structural geology Structural geology is the study of structures found in rocks. It's the study of structures found in rocks. It is also known as tectonic geology or simply tectonics. Now, don't confuse about the tectonics and the rocks uh, differences between the petrology and the structural geology. The only difference is it is a structures found on rocks and uh, it is a uh, it can be simply defined as study of tectonics it is a study of rocks that are found in te tectonics i repeat once again structural geology is about the study of te simply tectonics but whereas petrology is the study of rocks that are found in tectonics thanks for watching this is uday